Hello and welcome friends. A new case of probability, somewhat advanced level. And the problem is <clears throat> there are seven black and three white balls in a box or a bag, while four black and six white balls in another bag or box. A die is tossed, and if it shows number one or two. Two balls are drawn from the first bag or box, and if three, four, five, or six is shown on the die, <coughs> two balls are drawn from the second bag or box. If both the balls are black, find the probability that they came from second bag. But first of all, we are interested in the case two black balls are drawn. But what is the situation? A die is tossed. If one or two happens to be there on the top, first box is selected. Three or four or five or six happens to be on the top, second box is selected. What is the probability that two black balls are drawn? There only we can calculate the conditional probability of box two if two black balls have been drawn. So first. We are going to solve the problem through logical approach. In that, we can say that two black balls can be drawn in the following two mutually exclusive ways. Which are the two mutually exclusive ways? First box is selected as a result of this toss, and two black balls from it. Or the second box is selected. And two black balls from it. So probability of two black balls will be first box probability of first box one by three, and two black balls from it seven c two upon ten c two. Or second box is selected. 2 by 3 and two black balls from it 4c2 upon 10c2 so it will be 1 by 3 7c2 is 7 into 6 by 2 21 upon 10c2 10 into 9 uh, divided by 2 45 plus 2 by 3 into 7c2 uh, not it sort not b 7c2 Because black ball from the second is four c two. I'm very sorry for this mistake. Four c two four into three twelve divided by two six upon forty five. So ultimately it comes to twenty one upon one hundred thirty five plus twelve upon one hundred thirty five. That is thirty three upon one hundred thirty five. That is eleven by forty five. This is probability of drawing two black balls under this scenario. Now we have been given that the two balls drawn are black. What is the probability that they came from the second bag? So probability of second bag or box. If two black balls have been drawn, that is probability of second box. If two black balls, this is conditional probability. Probability of second box and two black balls. Probability of second ball, second bag and two black balls. This one, that is twelve by one hundred thirty-five divided by probability of two black balls. That is thirty-three by one hundred thirty-five. So it is twelve upon one hundred thirty-five divided by rather multiplied by one hundred thirty-five by thirty-three. So it comes to Twelve by thirty-three, or more precisely, four by eleven. 
my personal comment is in the logical approach this part becomes harder because it is not everybody's cup of tea to think the entire problem in this way but up to calculation of two black balls rather drawing two black balls i think it is somewhat easier even for the beginner now the formula approach let us assign the probabilities event a1 box 1 is selected event a2 box 2 is selected and event b two black balls are selected and as we know that p of a1 is 1 by 3 because if 1 or 2 happens on the die first box is selected similarly p of a2 is 2 by 3 but p of b we cannot calculate p of b directly but we can calculate conditional probabilities of b probability of two black balls if first bag is selected that will be 7c2 upon 10c2 that is 7 into 6 42 21 by 45 similarly p of b given a2 probability of selecting or drawing two black balls if second box is selected that is 4c2 upon 10c2 so it comes to 6 by 45 now p of b probability of two black balls is joint probability rather addition of joint probabilities a1 intersection b plus a2 intersection b and we know that this is possible p of a1 into p of a1 intersection rather sorry p of b given a1 here we are using the general law of multiplication of probabilities plus p of a2 into p of b given a2 we have all these four probabilities 1 by 3 into 21 by 45 see the same step plus 2 by 3 into 6 by 45 so ultimately it is 21 by 135 plus 12 by 135 that is 33 upon 135 or 11 by 45 now inverse probability or revised probability of second box if two black balls have been drawn that is p of a2 given b and now we know that p of a2 given b is p of a2 intersection b upon p of b p of a2 intersection b is here with us 21 by 135 divided by 33 by not sorry not 21 but it is 12 because we are going to calculate the probability of second box I by mistake wrote the probability of first so 12 by 135 divided by 33 upon 135 it is 12 by 135 into 135 by 33 so it comes to 12 by 33 or 4 by 11 okay now it is upon you to compare these two approaches Whichever is easier is yours. Thank you very much.